Hey everyone, this is Aaron on the Fusion 360 team with another quick tip. In this quick tip, I want to show you how to modify your selections. Before I get into doing that, I want to show you something that Fusion does in the background. If I use the drop down under select, I can look at some of my selection filter options, and you'll notice that, you know, right now it's not filtering for anything. Once I'm in a command, like fillet, chamfer, whatever, it's going to actually automatically filter to what you're looking to select. So in this case, I'm trying to do a fillet, so it automatically wants to look for body edges. Now let's go ahead and add these fillets to the grip pieces that are missing them. And I'll select the first and second edge and everything's going well. And then I want to type in the value so I can start to visualize this fillet. Now the third selection, you might notice, doesn't want to happen. That's because once you start visualizing the fillet, additional selections will require another input. This additional input is the command or control key. Let's go ahead and add the third fillet here, just holding command or control. And then we'll add the fourth one. And once I let go of that key, it's going to enable me to visualize the fillets once again. The fillet here is a little bit too small, so let's go ahead and deselect that. To deselect it, just hold the command or control key once again. From there, we can add a new fillet, and this design's almost done. Hope that helps. Have a great week. See ya.